What's going on everybody out there on the internet? My name is Feared Angel and welcome back to more World of Warcraft. Uh, it has been a very long time since I've recorded anything with the whole coronavirus thing going on. Family can't really go anywhere on my recording days, so, you know, today they are found someplace, something to do while I'm recording. But yeah, so I haven't had a chance to record at all. Um, cool thing is, however, that we have a wisdom, uh, Winds of Wisdom buff for everybody is going on right now because of the whole virus. Um, we get 100% increased experience, and that does uh, add up with our uh, heirlooms and uh, war mode. So all of that together, let's see, we have 100% from there. Uh, from all my heirlooms, I'm having 20... 25, 35, uh, 45, 50, 55. So 55, 155 plus the 25. What is that? That's uh, 80. 180, almost 200% experience. Almost. Not quite. Uh, we are heading to Darkshire, by the way. Uh, welcome to Elowin Forest. It's a beautiful place. So yeah, this is the perfect time to recording this game. Um, I have other games to record, but I'm kind of what? What the heck? There's a bunch of dead people here. What the heck? All right, I'm just gonna just gonna act like I didn't see that. Just gonna just gonna keep on keeping on. Just gonna keep on keeping on. Uh, we we do have some dungeons to do still. Um, we have. Did we do Shadowfin Keep? We didn't do Shadowfin Keep, did we? I don't think we did. Now yeah, we got Shadowfin Keep. So we're going to be leveling up like crazy. The dungeons, you get like almost two levels per dungeon. It's pretty nutty. So we're probably going to level up quite fast today. Um, or, you know, the ne while this buff's active. Um, I'm still planning on doing, like, splitting up the, the Let's Play into, like, different series, like... When we're on classic, or, sorry, vanilla, the, you know, and then Burning Crusade will be its own, like, let's play, but it's, like, the same character, just kind of, like, just kind of organize it better, instead of having, like, a 400-part series. Um, I'm also still planning to do, um, like, leveling up my professions, though I'm not gonna, like, I'm not gonna show off too much of the profession size, but we are gonna cap out our professions within each expansion. And then, uh, I kind of want to show off some things. I don't know. Do the pet battle stuff. Um. What else? What else? What else? Do the pet battle stuff. Kind of show off every zone. I want to show off all the raids. So, um, if you are on my friends list in the game, there's my battle.net right there. ID. Um. So, keep a lookout might be sending people a message who want to maybe it'll be part of my uh, part of the let's play and help me go through like certain raids like molten core black wing lair etc etc each expansion hopefully all right welcome to stormwind keeps this is obviously or, sorry, Stockade. Stormwind Stockade. This is obviously the, uh... The prison. For, um... How are you? Have a good one. For the bad people. Uh, go. Oh, I need to get this quest. I need to get this quest real quick. Yeah, so this is... The... Forgot what my moves are. Um, yeah, prison. Sorry, I was. I haven't played this character in a while. I just kind of remember what I have everything set to. <laughs> um, what the heck is? It's like a. It's like something's falling asleep and in infinitely. I don't know what that sound is. It's kind of creeping me out. I'm getting creeped out. You are now honored with Stormwind. 
Heck yeah. Do I have chain lightning yet? When do I get chain lightning? Ooh, we got chain heal though. Oh, I didn't... I didn't, uh... Crap. I didn't keybind chain heal. I didn't even realize I totally forgot I got that. We'll be alright. We'll be alright. So, uh, the first boss we're gonna have... Put this over here while I read this is Randolph Malak, Convict A C three one seven. Randolph Malak charges embezzlement. Hey, level twenty one. Embezzlement, fraud, theft, homicide, homicide. Jesus. Malak has been identified as the ringleader of the Prison Revolt. Given his connection to the House of Nobles, however, the use of lethal force to subdue this conquered is off. Uh oh. Uh, whoops. Uh, I totally wasn't paying attention. That was my bad. Uh, yeah. So I was reading that and the tongue just died. Sorry. What the heck? I'm dying. 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 God. Okay. Yeah, this doorway here... For the Stormwind Stockade right here when you pull, there's a lot of line of sight issues and you can't really heal them. But I was also reading stuff, so I already knew that. Alright. Done reading that now. Focus on the freaking game, dude. Shooting a lava burst at people. Oh wait, there's a new add-on. I didn't even realize I had an add-on. Uh, I need to disable that add-on. It's just the health thing. You need to disable that. I don't want my... For the Let's Play, you know, I have a lot of add-ons that I use when I actually play, but when I'm recording, I don't want my screen all muddled with stuff. Which is the reason why I disabled pretty much most of them, if not all. Except Healbot, I'm not disabling Healbot. He likes to stab people. He turns invisible and stabs people. It's called wild stabbing, as you can see. And then he vanishes and he picks out somebody. Nothing. I didn't get any loot from him at all. Come on, let's go kill Lord Overheart. Come on. All right, next person. Lord Over Overheart is our next boss coming up on the elemental prison side. Convict in A, Lord Overheat. Oh wait, I do have Chain Heal activated. I didn't even realize that. Oh, I guess I did do it. Alright, uh, charges homicide multiple counts. The natural disasters wrought by the cataclysm caused elements to abrupt into the prison complex, slaughtering half of the inmates upon arrival. So they just popped in the prison and just started killing the inmates. It's pretty funny. Alright, so this is what Chain Heal looks like. Let me go ahead and activate it. See, is it? Yeah, see, it jumps from target to target like a big wave of water. That's what we do, man. And so this is your AoE. You got pretty. You, you have like two AoE moves or heals. You've got your Chain Heal, and then later on you're going to get Healing Rain, which. When do we get that at? We get that at level 40, so it's going to be a while before we use Healing Rain. But those are pretty much your two main... main moves. And then as soon as I get Chain Lightning, my AoE damage is going to skyrocket. Dottie just put on me. Just spam chain heal and heal us all. Yeah. Shaman healing. Yeah, so shaman healers are all about, like, huge heals. It's kind of like holy. Like holy, um... Like priest holy. So it's like... Every, every healer kind of has their own sort of different sort of healing play style, if you want to really call it that. There are, you know, when you play a healer, a lot of them are really kind of feel the same. 
Uh, except maybe like druids. Druids, they heal with pretty much everything they have besides like regrowth and swift mend. Is is they're like instant heal over times. Not a whole lot of big numbers coming off of them. Uh, shamans. Sh I mean, I'd say shamans, holy priests, and holy priests kind of feel the same. It's just kind of like the f class flavor. Like how they use, like what they use, like water versus holy. Like, like There's not really a whole lot of difference when it comes to their base heals. Really? You got Discipline. Discipline, you do freaking crap ton of damage. Discipline's pretty fun to play there. Pretty unique. Holy Paladins are like a tanky... It's kind of weird. They're, they're a lot of instant... I, well, no. I'd say that ho Holy Paladins are the, the heals that are all about instant big heals. I would say that they have the biggest biggest numbers like if you're healing they don't have like a lot of heal over times but they have a lot of huge heal you all the way up with one freaking spell alright so this next boss go ahead and put this down here so I don't let them die the last boss this is a very quick dungeon it's gonna be a very quick video is hogger too many to list here for his charges imprisoning the river paw leader has come at a high cost, including the partial blinding of the Warden. Fearing that Hogger might escape, the Thelwater has authorized the Null's termination with extreme prejudice. Extreme prejudice. Hogger. Now, if you're pretty new to the game, you might not understand the meme behind Hogger, but Hogger was a... Uh, he's a was a very difficult NPC in Elowen Forest that killed a lot of people, like new players, because he was like an elite. He was like the first elite you fight, and he's surrounded by a bunch of other gnolls and stuff. So you might not get the meme if you haven't been playing a while, but yeah, now in Cataclysm, he got arrested, and then he... And then he, uh... Now he, when you put him in here, you actually do a quest line to arrest him, and then he's uh, he comes in here and he starts a revolt, man. Big old hogger. Except he has a really annoying move where he he slows your casting speed tremendously. Gotta yeah, interrupt it. I'm gonna interrupt it. I'm not letting him get that off. It's called Maddening Call. And when he casts it, your casting speed is just just horrendous. I think this Oh, our paladin is tanking now. We have a new player, I think, who hasn't really understood the game. Uh oh, he's enraged. Uh oh. And there we go, Stormwind Stockhead. Done. Just like that. Get rid of this cloth stuff. I need to. Alright, what do we got? Shield, eye patch, staff, or a ring. I don't need any of this. Or the Alliance. Crap, my inventory, man. I need bags, but I don't have any. I don't got no cash for nothing. Hey, level 22, we got Purifying Spirit. That's a good one. We need that one. That is a move to get rid of curses and stuff. Yeah, curses and magic effects. Definitely need that on my stuff. And I need to edit my bars, but we need to turn in these quests first. I need to put Purifying Spirit on in my skins, actually. I need to edit my skin, too. Take that to group. Uh, hang on. I need to do this off screen. Hey there. Anyways, turn these around. in. 
As you can see, we leveled up twice since coming in here. Very good. All right, and there we go. That was Stormwind Stockade, ladies and gentlemen. All right, let's get the heck out of here. Let's get the heck out of here and keep, keep trucking on. Keep trucking on. Um, oh, crap. Oh, yeah, and then I come out of here. Crap. I need to... Got to put my my weapons back on, man. All right. My inventory so I need to sell so bad. That on. Do I get any new upgrades that I didn't forget about? Remember? No. Okay. You know what I need to do? I need to make new sets. So these sets here, right here. Uh, what making a set does is say you're gonna switch a lot between two. Sp Specs, and you need to wield certain gear for it. This makes it so you just come up here and press this, and it will automatically equip this. So then, if I put on these two, because we're going to switch through these two specs, uh, Resto and Enhancement. Call it Resto. And there, see, now look. Oh, my inventory's full, though. I can't do it like that. There we go. Let's try it now. See? Then, boom! Automatically equips my two hammers. There we go. Very useful if you're switching between two. Hey, rare. Terrapis. Come on now, Terrapis. Damage. We're all fish. Okay. Um, right. Alright guys, I'm getting it here. This is a little quicker of a video than I normally do. But, uh, I need to mess with some of these add-ons that I have here. But until next time, guys, peace off. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you liked the video, leave a like. And make sure to share it around the internet and worldwide. You can check out my Patreon links in the description and on the screen now. Don't forget to come by our Discord and say hello to everybody. And last but not least, make sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Peace out.